After 16 years of, 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 of doing this art every day for 16 years, I was awarded the eighth degree, which carries a, let's see, eighth degree. There's only 10 degrees of black. What's up, guys? So, um, I want to talk about something very interesting. Okay, so this footage I found online, and it's of Elvis doing um, a karate demonstration September 1st, 1974. Now, you can kind of tell, like, something's not right. Like, why would Elvis just be, like, doing, like, you know what I mean? And he, he segues that into, um, if you talk in your sleep. And it's like, what the heck's going on? While part of me thinks it's cool that Elvis is doing a karate demonstration, he actually had this, like, somewhat planned. Because you can see, like, Red West came on stage, totally dressed in uh, his, you know, karate uniform, his uh, G or whatever it's called. And, um, you know, Elvis doing a karate demonstration. You could tell something's not right. Now, this is the point of this video. Not only do I want you to see this rare footage, but also let's talk about something, okay? Now, a brief history of what's going on. Okay, so a little bit of a backstory. Elvis does in 1973, Aloha from Hawaii. Uh, we all know the success. He got himself in shape. Uh, then in February, quick note, he meets Muhammad Ali, which is cool. But then, you know, he starts to have like a meltdown with um, three people jump the stage in February 73. And uh, he begins to think that, you know, it's Mike Stone that had these guys do this. And, um, you know, so he gets into this thing where, uh, you know, according to the books I've read, Elvis What Happened, many other books, Elvis... Um, you know, wants to put a hit on Mike Stone. I'm sure a lot of you are very familiar with this. Um, then you get into Elvis having like very uninspired uh, sessions in July, um, recording sessions. You know, he ends up going to the hospital. He's hospitalized uh, later that year. But then things turn around for him. January 1st, 74, um, he's back in concert, doing a great job. Then you got the March you know, the um, uh, the Homecoming C CD, well, it's a CD now, but it was a record, Homecoming, where he won a Grammy for uh, uh, How Great Thou Art, and then you got, you know, his, he, he looked like he was doing great, and then, like, to the point that I want to make in this video, and pay attention to this point, what happened to Elvis? Like, in August, August 16th, you know, if you guys have the FTD, um, he uh, does a lot of work in preparation for his uh, summer opening in Vegas, okay? And he did a completely different song listing, only a few oldies in there. He put a lot of work into it, a lot of new songs, um, if you talk in your sleep. Uh, Good Time Charlie's Got the Blues. He has a different opener. I think it was Big Boss Man. Uh, correct me. You know, I'll correct I know. I mean, actually, I know you guys will correct me if anything is wrong, but uh, uh, you know, he just does. He doesn't do suspicious minds. Uh, he does pokes at any, but it's like a totally new. He only threw in. I think he did uh, Hound Dog at the end and Love Me Tender just because he was getting so many um, requests for it. But think about this. Okay, middle of August. August nineteenth was the opener. Elvis, it was in good shape, good mentally, and just doing awesome now look at this september 1st you see this footage like what what's going on you know something's not right 
September 2nd, 74. He does the strung out. And I'll tell you something, friend. I have never been strung out in my life, except on music. If I find or hear the individual that has said that about me, I'm going to break your goddamn neck, you son of a bitch. Talk, you know, that he's not strung out. And then he's going to pull, um, you know, whoever's been talking crap about him for missing some shows. Their, their tongue he's going to pull out by the roots and all this stuff. And then you get into College Park in October. And then Elvis starts to put on weight, you know, later and, and in 75. And it's downhill. What happened? You know, like in, um, you know, back to what I was saying in 1973, um, at the end of 73, he goes back to sax, release, like, records Loving Arms, you know, all, um, uh, what was that one? Uh, Honky Tonk Angel, you know what I mean. So many good songs. And then it brings him into 74, he's doing great. A very, uh, a lot leaner, more in shape, looking good. Like, if you look at some of the um, uh, picks from, like, August 74, he's looking really good, but he does have a descended, distended stomach, um, you know, which is a little concerning. But hear me out. August 19th, he, he gives a great show. He's really into it. Obviously, the drugs, he increased them evidently. Why? Why did he do that? Was it because... You know, I, I also read that uh, August 19th, he was disappointed because he put so much effort into revamping his show, doing songs he wanted to do, and the crowd response was not that great. And then the next show, he went back to his like original plan, opening up with CC Rider, the whole deal. Could it have been that like, hey, I tried so much to and put so much effort into doing this show right or how I want to do it in a new updated style and the fans didn't want it and I have to go back to singing Hound Dog and all these other songs that Elvis was passed. What happened, you know, by early September and he was even missing shows and then you got the strung out speech August 2nd, then Elvis goes on the road and the College Park uh, October 6th. What happened, do you think? Comment down below. I'll leave you with this uh, song, Poke Salad Annie. Uh, parts of it from that same night, September 1st. It's kind of interesting. I like that tiger suit he's wearing. But tell me, what do you think happened? Elvis, what happened summer 1974? Because I just did a video on uh, the best performances from 1974. And I think all of them are pre-summer. So it's, you know, you got um, January, March, and uh, just getting into August. But that was with the rehearsals. So tell me what you guys think in the comments down below. It's very interesting point. What happened in August? Okay. Uh, make sure you hit the subscribe button, like, and comment down below. When you like, if you just watch the video and uh, don't hit the like button or anything, it does not do anything for the channel. But if you enjoy this channel, um, comment on it, leave a like, even a dislike if you don't agree with what I'm saying. Leave a dislike. Leave some something that you were there. And also, I want to let you know again about some of the other um, channels that I have that you could be interested in, which I think you will be. So, check out Elvis is the Man and enjoy the rest of this video.